We want to dig deeper into the weather chaos that is Buffalo and Erie County in western New York. It is, says the governor of New York, a once in a century kind of storm. And Ms. Hochul says we ought to get used to it happening much more frequently than that. Of the nearly 50 Americans who have been killed nationwide, about half that number have been killed in Buffalo and the rest of Erie County. Tonight, the fallout from the treacherous weather across the country, the strongest cold snaps we've seen in decades. Certainly it is the blizzard of the century. And many facing life-threatening situations. I heard him screaming for help. In Buffalo, in western New York, Shakira Autry reached out to the community for help after she heard a man in his 60s, Joseph White, in distress from extreme cold outside her home this weekend. I can't do no more. I just can't have this man uh, uh, lose his life in my house. I have did everything that I can do. This man needs help. I'm Strangers in her neighborhood seeing her message on Facebook and taking him to a nearby emergency room, his hands appearing to have severe frostbite. A driving ban still in effect in Buffalo after many people got stranded on the highways. And at one moment, almost every fire truck in Buffalo stuck on the roads and for the first time ever, unable to answer calls. And the Buffalo airport, it's gonna be closed at least until Wednesday. And more snow is falling. Buffalo on and off showers tonight, what could lead to a total of five feet of snow before this is all done tomorrow afternoon.